Thunder Bay Police are investigating the city's sixth homicide of the year. Officers were called to a Southside home on Sunday afternoon after a deceased male was discovered. Police have now confirmed it was a shooting death that's believed to be related to the drug trade. Josh Morano was at the scene and has more. Thunder Bay Police have yet to release any information on the victim other than the fact it was a male. It's suspected the murder took place between 8 p.m. Saturday night and 6 a.m. Sunday morning. The 300 block on Ogden Street has since been taped off with officers remaining on scene. While the investigation is still ongoing, Detective Inspector Jeremy Pearson confirmed that a firearm was involved in the incident. He goes on to say that investigators believe the city's latest homicide is related to the ongoing drug trade. While I understand and certainly sympathize with public concern for any homicide involving a firearm, uh, I do offer that in terms of our investigative theory leading us down the line that this is not a random act and is not uh, someone at large with random ill intent. A neighbour in the area says the house where the crime occurred is a known drug den, adding they've seen suspicious looking visitors coming in and out at all hours of the day and night. Pearson is now turning to those neighbours and asking the community to help by supplying security camera footage or for eyewitnesses to come forward. And part of the reason that I'm before you here today is to ask for any public in the area that may have surveillance video at their residence, anyone who may have been driving in the area at that time with dash cam video, or anyone who may have been in the area between those hours. I realize it's a broad uh, time frame, but anyone who may have been in the area between those hours who witnessed something, uh, I ask them to contact our investigators. Pearson says investigators will remain open to other theories as more evidence is discovered. A full post-mortem autopsy is expected to take place in Toronto. Josh Morano, TBT News.